lovely. Now, for those who don't know, why is now the right time for a silk press? Okay, so if you've ever pressed your hair out on vacation mm -hmm. or in the summer mm -hmm. and you head outside, that press is not going to last past maybe five minutes or so. The humidity is going to take it right back. Absolutely. So right now, because of the weather conditions, because it's so dry in the air, your hair is mm -hmm. going to be able to manage to keep the silk press. Okay, before we get into the products, because we've got to talk about prep, I just yeah. want to talk about this whole silk press situation. Please. We, we did Please. grow up with a silk press. It was Thank not called you. a silk press. Thank it was, you. It was called, called the Marcel comb. Iron. That's okay. Right. It was called the hot comb. <laughs> On the stove top. Yes. Your shoulders at your ears, <laughs> hoping your mother doesn't nick your Glips ears. in your ears for dear life. Yes. Yes. That's, that's our the generation press. we came from. Mm -hmm. uh, the internet made up the term silk press, so we're just going to go with we're it. We're going to go with it. It's a rebrand. It's lovely. Okay. Um, and you need to prep your hair for it. Absolutely. So the first and most important thing that people want to skip over is getting your hair super clean. Yes. If your hair is filled with a lot of oils and butters from maybe your twist out, yeah. that's going to come out in the press and your bathroom's going to be smoky. Right. And <laughs> it's just going to be a mess. So you've yeah. got to start out with a clarifier. Okay. And a hot tip here is that if you let that clarifier sit for a few minutes, don't do four shampoos. Mm -hmm. Put the clarifier in, let it sit for five or six minutes, yeah. and then go on to your moisturizing shampoo. Okay. Mm. So that clarifier takes all of the stuff out. Exactly. Okay, then you go to your moisture shampoo. Right. And the, then our next step. You know what it is, Tracy. It's a protein It's not the conditioner. It's the protein treatment. It's the protein treatment. And the protein treatment is really important because protein packed really closely together is what actually makes our hair curly. Okay. Right? So many of us have stories of when we've gone somewhere to get our hair pressed out. A week later or so, you wash it. Yeah. And then it's straight. It doesn't go back. It doesn't go back. That's the heat damage. Oh. So to avoid that, you want to use something that's going to give you that protein, that's going to keep that protein in your hair. Mm -hmm. That's the protein treatment. Okay, now mm -hmm. what's the next step? Now we're reconditioning? Okay, then you can condition your okay. hair and follow with the right leave-ins. Okay, what are we looking for in our leave-ins? If you're using heavy oils, you're yeah. going to have that same problem as before. Yeah. Your hair's going to be greasy, it's going to be stuck to your face, you're mm -hmm. not going to get the style you want. If yeah. you want that bouncy, flowing look, you have to use something that's cream-based yeah. and then a little silicone. So okay. I like these leave-ins here. This combination's got the moisture, yeah. and then you're going to get the shine here with the silicone. Oh, really good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we talked about all the products, the leave-in products. We're ready to go. One more. One more. Heat protection. That's right. Crucial. Crucial if you want your hair it, to right? snap back. Exactly. So especially through the blow drying process, yeah. I like to layer my leave-ins and then go in with the heat protection before yeah. I start to blow dry. Okay. okay. We're prepped. We're ready to go. Let's bring Natalie in our model. Give her some love. Come on and have a seat. Okay. So she's sort of halfway through a silk press right now. Yes. And let me just say, this is really important to note. Yeah. Because folks will say, well, why did you bring this model with like a weave? Right. No. This is uh, Natalie's parents. Right. <laughs> this that's is her Natalie. genetics. This and is that's Natalie's her hair. genetics. <laughs> <laughs> so she's natural all the way through. Yes. We took her through all the steps of clarifying the leave ins, mm -hmm. the blowout, and now we've got two sections. Or okay. three, rather. Okay. The sectioning is a big part of this. Okay. Right? Yes, because after you wash your hair, mm -hmm. right, if you blow dry from maybe 50% wet, yeah. you're going to get through the blow dry a little bit faster. Okay. Right? Yeah. And then you want your blow dry to look a little something like this. Ooh, Natalie, we are there touching each other a lot. <laughs> it happens. There we go. You want to spend the time really in the blow dry because the flat iron right. is only supposed to pass maybe once or twice over your hair. Okay. If you gotta go over it six times, like your hair's gone. It's a problem. It's leaving you. So you really have to do, you, you really have to restrain yourself from going over and over and over. So with the blow dry, what, like a couple of passes? So the blow dry, you can take your time and get it straight. It's okay. the flat iron. You okay. don't want to go over too many times. Got with. it. Okay. So we've got done, we've got just blow dried, and over here we have we've just got, washed. Yes, we've okay. got just washed. Oh, beautiful. And okay. what is our next step? Okay. So our next step is to actually press out her hair. So I like to work in small sections. Yeah. If you're working with really big sections, mm -hmm. you're going to have to go over in more and more passes. Right. We right? all think we can just speed through. 
take a big chunk and then just flat iron the whole thing and exactly. that's not how you're not going to get the When you speed through life, result. you get poor results. Yes. When you speed through your silk press, you also get poor results. These are words to live by. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go. So we're going to take our time, smooth it down. I'm also following with the carbon comb. This right. comb is going to help to cool the hair. Yes. So that you get that beautiful shine right after. Oh, see, I would have never known that. Exactly. So it's not a plastic it's comb. It's not a plastic comb because the plastic comb's not going to make it. It's going to it's going to melt <laughs> on the way down. Exactly. And By the time you get to the issue. bottom, you're going to have no teeth to your comb. Right. <laughs> beautiful. There we are. Look at that. So two passes. Mm -hmm. And you go from the beautiful blowout stage to the silky goodness that you're looking for. Exactly. So while you're doing that, I want to talk a little bit about maintenance. So you've gone through the whole process. My daughter's gone through this process from beginning to end in the new way versus mm. the shoulders at the ears at the, the <laughs> hot comb at She's the stove. She's not traumatized like us. She's not. She doesn't have the trauma <laughs> that I have. So she did it the, the way that we're doing it now, and that was a good five hours um, from natural hair washed all of the treatments thank you for telling the truth yeah it's five, it was five to six hours right <laughs> so let's talk a little bit about maintenance because this is the sort of thing you're going to want to hang on to for a while what exactly. do you need to do to once keep you've it? made that investment you're yeah. going to want to make sure that you're sleeping with the head tie and i've said this many times before yeah this style is not waterproof no <laughs> okay so especially when you go into the shower yeah i suggest keeping on that head tie yes and then putting on a shower cap on top of it yeah and don't take that shower cap off until you're out of the bathroom away from the steam that's right because the condensa condensation in there right it's, it's gonna still get very you humid. Right. Okay, so wrap your head at night. Make sure it's wrapped when you're taking a shower or a bath. And uh, how long might this last? You can get two weeks out of this if you are working out. It is also not sweat proof. Yeah, right. So it. Keep, <laughs> keep that in mind. Yeah. So save it for a special occasion if you can. Mm -hmm. um, put your fitness aside if you need to. <laughs> No workout. <laughs> Always a pleasure. Thank you. Thank